a lot of uh, the process and what we do, um, especially with the Ruthless and Toothless brand, is it's a collaboration. It's pretty much everybody's got a certain piece to give and a certain element to bring to all the artwork that we do. Um, so Jimmy and I are going to try and show today, you know, how that all works. You know, it's, it's pretty much it's you know the old proverb, the teamwork. You know, it, it's an amazing thing bringing everybody in, and it's amazing when you can bring the kids and show them something like that, where they can work together on something creative like that. They don't get that in many places, and I think this is somewhere we can show them that. We've had to tone down a lot of our stuff, uh, working with the kid element and uh, doing the children's line and everything. We've actually we spent a lot of time refining our artistic, I guess, integrity, if you want to call it, to making it more kid friendly. Um, a lot of our stuff is very, you know, adult orientated as far as like the dragons and like you know in the tattoo world. But doing stuff for kids, we found we really needed to tone it down. So we actually worked a lot off of like things that we used to do when we were younger. We started going back to things like using the anime and the comic books and stuff that started our pretty much careers in the drawing. So we kind of just took that, revisited it, and merged them both together and kind of came up with the, the Ruthless and Toothless style. You know, I, I think certain designs in general, uh, everybody can kind of relate to and have something in common with. Um, and that's pretty much what we're trying to do, give everybody a feel for what we're doing you know we're doing a children's design but it's still got a little edge to it it's something fun a little something that as well the parents can appreciate so that's pretty much the fine line that we kind of walk along every day a lot of times when i'm drawing at home it's funny i have my 18 month old son sitting next to me and i see what he reacts to and that's what i'll go with a lot of times in designing you know there's certain things that appeal to him and that's kind of i guess where we're going to take it today see what the kids yeah. are feeling and see if they want to go with it and take it from there and just show them as well that you know they can let the creativity go anywhere in any direction and that's not a bad thing.